Hello everyone with a special Thanksgiving Day 2022 beer and food pairing review. First beer and food pairing review I've done on the channel, so the video may run a little bit longer. First up, here is the beer we are reviewing today. It is the Saucony Creek Stonefly India Pale Ale from Saucony Creek Brewing Company in Cutstown, Pennsylvania. I believe that's Berks County, but don't quote me on that. And we also have here on a nice little plate, some very nice Kerrygold Reserve Cheddar, aged over two years from the lovely country of Ireland. So, and here is the lovely cheese, All chopped up on the plate, and we're gonna pour the beer now. Let's see how we make out. Crisp pop on the opening. I believe, from research I was doing earlier, this is a nice West Coast IPA. Oh, that's a lot of head on that. All right. Well, while we wait for that to settle, let's say we take a try of some of this lovely aged cheddar. It should not be as sharp as the American style, but maybe with another year. Clear profile, at least from what I've noticed from the uh, cheddars from the UK, Ireland region. <clears throat> Here we go. Mmm. Ooh. It does have a nice sharp kick to it, though. Mmm. Nutty. Good salt. Not too salty. Mmm. Fine, fine cheddar cheese. I generally dispense with the cracker nonsense. Just like the straight up cheese by itself. Yeah. Might as well finish the piece of cheese here while we check on the beer. Mmm. 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 Found that lovely cheese at my local Acme. They've been stepping up their cheese game lately. I try to find a good sheep cheese for Christmas time. Anyway, here is our lovely India Pale Ale. Clear, lots of good carbonation. Two finger white head. Let's take a sniff. Ooh, big grapefruit. And, um, ooh. You can almost smell the bitterness rolling off this one. It's a nice West Coast style IPA versus the New England stuff where it's cloudy and a little on the bland side. Well, not bland, just orangey, citrusy stuff. Cheers, everyone. Let's see what we got here. Mmm. Yeah. Starts off grapefruit. Just with some fruit and a little bit of piney, that good piney West Coasty bizzard and bitterness stuff. Very tasty indeed. Let's pour some more in the glass here. And grab a nice piece of cheese. See how we do together. Your mustache. Oh. Ah, beer and cheese. Go together like peanut butter and jelly. A sharp tang of the cheese, cut through by the bitterness and the carbonation. Helps to scrub that flavor off your palate. So you get a whole new, fresh burst of cheese. And you enjoy these again. Mm. 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 Very good stuff. Definitely recommend pairing that cheddar with that nice IPA. Now, I did go over to New Jersey and lived with my dad the other day and found some interesting 
stuff over there, Winter Ale from 21st Amendment, and a coffee stout from Maine Brew Company. Probably put the coffee stout on the channel on Wednesday. And let's see, and I got another IPA from Wisconsin I found around the neighborhood. So the next couple weeks are set for the beer tastings here. Hopefully I find a decent barley wine. Or maybe I'll try to find some Brooklyn chocolate stout to age in the fridge. So, until next week. Ooh, excuse me. Mmm, very tasty. Beer, cheese. Team it up. Buy that stuff again. And if you like what you're seeing here, push the, you know, the like and subscribe buttons down below there. Helps with the algorithm. Make some extra cash off of YouTube. Get some more beer and some more cheese. Thanks for watching and drink more beer.